Tonight is Touchdown Friday. The Havelock versus Jacksonville has a lot at stake, but it's one student's fight for recovery that's on everybody's mind. WNCT's Brandon Truitt joins us live from the game with more. Brandon? Angie, tonight's game just ended, and you know, a lot of the attention might have been on the football team, but for one band member tonight was extra special. AJ had extensive third degree burns on all his fingers, hands, and his arm. Havelock senior AJ Hawkins is recovering after gas from a boat caught fire. The accident on August 30th caused severe burns to his arms and face. Intense therapy, so it's about three hour sessions twice a day. AJ's mother, Vicki, says recovery has been a process. They're taking it step by step. He gets higher fast, uh, besides his skin um, healing. Um, a lot of healing going on in his body. Of course, that's making his metabolism very, very high. AJ is in the band and plays trombone, but it's the steps his band family is taking that's making a difference. I mean, we have like shirts, we have wristbands, and everything like help raise some money and everything. Uh, the 50 50 raffle tickets for the Havelock games are also, like, half of it goes to him. Nearly $10,000 raised in all. AJ's friends and fellow trombone players, Titus Horton, says it's all a part of the band family. It's like your regular family, but it's just people that you never thought you would talk to, but you end up being best friends with. It was with this family, AJ took his steps for senior recognition. Art Frazier. Proving with music, family and friends, recovery is possible. Everybody was always worried and wanting to know what happened and always there to comfort me. So it did, it really felt like everyone had their arms around me. Now all the money raised will go to paying AJ's medical bills. His father was also hurt in that incident. He's recovering well. I spoke to AJ off camera and you could just tell how excited he was to be here today. He is overwhelmed by the support he's been getting. Live in Havelock, Brandon Truitt, not on your side.